The Ukrainian army continues its operations in and around Zaporizhia. Intense clashes are taking place in the region, although not as much as in other regions. The Ukrainian army is trying to protect its positions by confronting the Russians in the Zaporizhia region, as well as Kherson in the south. There were important developments in the Tokmak region. It was reported that the Ukrainian army destroyed a Russian headquarters here. According to Melitopol Mayor Ivan Fedorov, 14 Russian military personnel, including several officers, were killed. Fedorov said a very powerful liquidation of the enemy has been taking place in Tokmak for two days in a row. The entire headquarters of the enemy has been destroyed. More precisely, there was an explosion during a meeting at the headquarters and at least 14 people were killed, including several officers, Fedorov said. Also, according to Fedorov, the Russian troops once again tried to cover themselves with civilians, so they placed the headquarters on the territory of the kindergarten. Fedorov also reported that Russians continue to concentrate in the area and Ukraine continues counteroffensive operations against Russians in the area. The Ukrainian defense blocks in the Zaporizhia region continue to repel the Russian attacks and continue counterattack operations against the Russian positions and hidden Russian positions, inflicting losses on the Russian army. It was also reported that there were wounded soldiers along with Russian soldiers killed in the attack of the Ukrainian army. What do you think about Ukraine's ongoing operations in and around Zaporizhia?